Okay, back to making the truck. We have everything we need. I'm gonna make this up on the countryside. Do I have coal in my inventory? Do I have like 100 coal? I don't. Let's go steal some coal really quick before I try to make this. This is gonna lag the game like crazy, by the way, so I apologize ahead of time. I know that once we get in the truck and start driving, it will lag a lot. I know that from the tractor, so just, uh, just be ready for that. Here we go. Should I make it up here or should I make it over there? I think I'm gonna make it over there. I want to make it... Well, wait, no. We're going to make it... Whoops. I'll make it over here, because this is a better spot. We'll actually have some some room to drive over here. Yeah, we'll make it, like, right here. Truck time. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. It kind of makes me think of a beetle for some reason. What's in front right there? Cool. Awesome. Uh, where do I put the fuel in? Where's the fuel pump spot? Where do we... Where do we got... Where, where does... Where's... Hey, I need to know how to put fuel into this guy. How do I... Can't drive it if I can't put fuel into it. Where's the gas tank, dude? Where's the gas tank? Is that it right there? I have to find the gas tank. I can't do this. Does it work? Oh, here we go. This is what we need. Booyah. Thank you. Okay. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Yeah, the game is... It's going to start lagging like crazy. I'm sorry. But this will be a fun moment. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Honk that horn. Honk it. Off-road time. Yeah, it's like lagging for me like mad. It's mad lag. <laughs> oh my god. It's actually keeping up on the stream pretty well. So. Uh-oh, we're gonna hit a tree. Oh! Oh, he smacked a tree. How fast can we get this sucker going? It looks like, like, 30 is like its max. 45, 50, 54. This is rad. The vehicles in this is act in this game are actually pretty fun, but like I said, it lags like crazy. I just wanted to build it to have it. I don't plan on really using it. Turn around. Stick it out. Whoa, everything got dark. Okay, let's go back. It would be kind of cool if you could make like a motorcycle in this game, but I swear it would lag like crazy. And I think if I had this running in the background, like if I had this delivering like you can, whoa, you can drift. And slide. Whoa! Uh oh. Oh. Well. <laughs> okay. Ooh, full stop, full stop! No! Don't hit my line of stuff. Oh, we can go up and over it. That's funny. Alright. I'm gonna park it right here. That was fun. After playing around with the tractor, like, you get the idea of what's going to happen with, with these guys. I could see that being kind of cool, but I swear, having that in the background, running and delivering stuff, would probably lag the heck out of the game. It really would. I can't imagine too many people set up the truck lines, but I could be wrong. Alright, how much? How many computers have you made? Twelve, nice. Nice. Good job. Okay. So, with where we are now, we're kind of just on the playing the waiting game a little bit. Let's see. Uh, we got 27 of those made. I mean, I could start making these things by hand. I would really rather not, though. Um, really rather not. I think at this moment we should probably hunt down some slugs. We can get um, we can get some power cells made, something like that. We can go from there. Ow! Um, one thing that I'm kind of worried about is I don't know what happens if I... S Let's try this. I have a ton of those motors. If I switch my milestone, does it keep my progress? That's what I want to know. So if we go over to this guy and we select this guy, does it keep the progress we made on this milestone? It does. So we need zero. This one needs 50. This one needs 50. Cool. 
So it saves it. It's not like we have to keep going back and doing it or whatever. That was my worry, because I want to I wanna do this while we're waiting. Because we should have a thousand wire. <laughs> the pink. I forgot about that. We should have a thousand wire stocked up over here. Easily. Like, we should, yeah, see, this guy is like, this guy is almost at capacity. Um, we need 200 cables. So, we should probably go grab some regular copper wire. Jumping through this. It's like running through a jungle. Oh, that's a cliffside. That's a cliffside. Alright. Uh, modular frames and rotors. The rotors are going to be the... Maybe the, the one that's kind of a pain in the butt. But we'll find out. Let's, let's check. Okay, so... Cables were fine. Um, let's see. Modular frames. We need, what, 10? 10, 10 mod modular frames. Which I think just means we need more uh, alternate stitched. Let's make a little, couple of these really quick. So we need 10 modular frames. It's fine for now. Stop there. And then we need rotors, which is screws. Didn't we have another way to make rotors? Didn't we get something like that? I don't think so. Okay, so, rotors, we just need screws. Boo. Boo! Boo. We need enough to make 50 rotors. That's a pain in the butt. So, what's 50 times 20? Is... Freaking thousand, something like that. We're gonna have to go grab more rods. Gonna need a lot of this. Gonna need a lot of this. Did I make modular frames? Um, I need rods for those too. Let's grab a bunch of rods. Okay, we'll take, we'll take like three stacks of these. All right, there we go. Back over here. Uh, excuse me, thank you. All right, did I already do this? No, I didn't. I need ten of these. Okay, and ten. Perfect. Okay. So now we need enough screws to make 50 rotors. Why can't it be the 50 freaking like engines or whatever? So much easier. Problem is there's probably gonna come a point where it's gonna tell me that I can't. I can make less and less rotors because of using the bars for screws. Maybe, that might happen. It might not, I don't know. Come on, come on. There we go. Yep, there it is. I did hit that point. I knew that was going to happen. Alright. So, give me this. Okay. So, we need now to just make 50 rotors. Then we'll make our cables. So, we got the 50 modular frames. We need 50 rotors. And then we need the cables. And we should we should be able to finish Caterium Electronics. Fancy. Fancy electronics? We're getting places. We're at the point right now where it's just time. Because we'll make that fuel generator. And then, like, and we'll make the jetpack, of course. Probably, like, we'll make all the stuff. Um, but we're just kind of waiting for our resources. So we're working on other stuff while we're waiting for the resources. That's basically how we're going right now. I mean, 200 cables. With 30. And then we will finish up this extra tier. Which is funny because I need to make supercomputers and probably something else to put into the MAM. And I don't know if we're going to have actually anything to really use them for. So it's kind of like, I don't know if they're going to be very needed right now. But we'll have them. We'll have the ability to make them. So. Yeah, our list of stuff is, is getting near, near the bottom, that's for sure. I'm getting near the end. But I want to get the fuel generator first, because I'd like to make that before we start making, like, all the other stuff. Alright, so we have what we need for this one. Let's do this. Underlay. Underlay! You go here. Bingo. You. You. Uh, ten of these guys, and fifty of these guys. Bingo. And send it off. Shabam! A more okay. specialized use of Caterium has been unlocked. Smart splitters and new advanced electronic parts are now available. 
3, you can set a rule for which part goes to the left and which part should go to the right. Interesting. So basically you can merge more things into one line and then just have it split. I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess, but not really... I don't know if it's really all that important. Um, here we go. Let's see, so we got some more stuff. Let's look at some of this other stuff that we got. Supercomputer. Wow, that takes a lot, huh? Computer, AI limiter, high-speed connector, and plastic. What does it take to make a high-speed connector? Cable, plastic. That's actually not that bad to make that in all reality. It's like the computer that's the main issue. <laughs> um, AI limiter is a circuit board and a quick wire. So we've got. let's make a bunch of plastic really quick. I've got a bunch of these drums. Let's make some plastic. Should be able to make a couple circuit boards. Now we can make an AI limiter. Funny. So I've made an AI limiter. It keeps the AI from uh, going crazy and skynetting all over us. Alright, let's get a couple more stacks of these bad boys. And you. Some Caterium wire, if you will. Alright. Let's go back over here. Okay. So, what was it for the circuit board? Oh, yeah. And then here, it's this. What does it take for a supercomputer? We need this high speed connectors. So, we need cable and plastic. We need like a ton of plastic. That's what we need. Plastic out the wazoo, man. Plastic for, for days. So, let's go up here. I kind of like, I really don't want to mess with what we got going on here too much. But let's see if plastic is backed up. Oh, dude, it's backed up to no end. Like we have we have more plastic than we can handle, I think. Yeah, this is good. This is really good. So, plastic. It's almost like, what's funny is, it's almost like you could build, um, let's get a bunch of plastic. You could build, what's it called? Like the smart splitter, just to organize stuff for you. Like, that's how it feels, to a degree. Or you could have, like, them all go into one line, so you don't have these multiple lines like I do here. But I just don't really care that much, honestly. Like, I'm cool with this. This doesn't bother me. Um, it's fun. It's fun to see, like, big messy lines and stuff. Uh, okay. So what are we doing again? Get my brain back on board. Uh, we need 10 supercomputers. To make 10 supercomputers, we need... 20 AI limiters which means we need 10 we need like a bunch of these we need 16 of these so let's get 16 of these made perfect AI limiter we're gonna make the 10 supercomputers by hand we're IT today we're gonna be IT tech Okay, so for high-speed connectors, we need cables. That's all we need. We just need a bunch of cables. Cool. All right, I think I can come over here. Ay, 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 ay. Stop. Oh. Well, that's not good. Luckily, this is backed up a little bit, but I didn't realize. So we need cables. I don't think I need to be up here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Before we go down, how many computers do we need for the supercomputer? Do I even need one? I'm pretty sure I need like 20. Do I need any? Co no, I need supercomputers. Sorry. Um, yeah. So to make 10, we're gonna need 20 super. We're gonna need 20 regular computers to make 20 to make 10 supercomputers. So we're gonna go steal 20 from here. Even though we're trying to stock up on these and not use them up. Wow, that super sucks. That's all we have. We have exactly 20 made. It's because of the screws. I would bet you money that we're waiting on screws. Actually. Yeah, we are. Look. What I should do is get, like, a big stack of screws and come put them up here. That would help this out immensely. That's okay. It's not a big deal. Um, anyways, so now we've got the computers. So we need the circuit. We need 30 circuit boards. 30, not circuit boards. High-speed connectors. 30 high-speed connectors. That's easy. That's super easy. Um, do I even have, do I have, 
Excuse me. That's not what I want. Don't pick that up. Stop. Open your inventory, you dingus. Um, do I have regular with me? I do. I don't even need to do that. It means to make if, to make 30 of these. Actually, I do need to go down there. Never mind. Because I need like I need to make like 300. Whoa, that was a mistake. Ouch. Ouchiwawa. Okay, so give me a good amount of this. And I'm going to turn around and I'm going to, for aesthetic's sake, not really, but just for the sake of laziness, I'm going to leave a drum right here. There you go. Looks good. It really gives me that factory feel. Let's run over here. Oh, we need to make a bunch of cables. Okay. Hey, look. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed. I think I need, what was it, 10 for each and we need 30, so we need 300 cables. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm going to run out of space before I'm able to do that. Alright, let's put some junk away really quick. Um, we want to get rid of... Let's see, we'll do the small stack of this. We'll throw in here. Let's get rid of the old fuel. I don't really need that on me. We'll do... Combine this stack of rubber. We have a single coal. And we have, yeah, like a five stack of coal. It's ridiculous. This is why I have no room in my inventory. Um, plastic, combine those. Uh, Caterium, get out of my face. And then we'll keep everything else. This is all. The rest of it's fine. So, let's see. Where are we at? Got a hundred. We need three hundred. We'll get those ten supercomputers, and then we can get into the MAM, and the MAM can start analyzing them. And then maybe we'll get more stuff involving supercomputers that'll unlock more crafting things. I don't know. Something. I really want to get the mycelia, but like I don't want to chop down trees. <laughs> I could just I don't. That's how you get the freaking mushrooms. I don't want to do it. I just don't want to do it. Just don't want to do it. Okay. We're almost there. And we are just about done. Bingo. Why can we not do this? What am I missing? Oh, I think I'm going to run out of wires, actually. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we're going to run out of wires. So I'm going to have to go get some more of those really quick. Don't even finish this. Come back. It's right here, so it's not that big of a deal. Whoa! I need just one more stack of 500. And there's a thing right here, so I don't have to run all the way back over there. Yeah, that's good. Um, okay. What are we doing here again? High-speed connectors. There we go. Pew. Do it up. 30 of these. We're making computers, man. It's a computer builder simulator now. Come on. If I'm if I'm not gonna make it to ten, I'm gonna be super mad. If something like keeps me at nine, like I did the math wrong or something. Bam, we did it. Ten supercomputers. Heck yeah, man. This is nuts. This takes, like, so much effort, I swear. Three, two, and one. Bingo. Let's go plug these suckers in. Sha sha. Dun 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 dun. Alright, so we got supercomputers to throw in here. It looks like we can get like more of this stuff. I don't know. Well, no, it would be lit up if we could plug any of this in. So we can't plug any of this in. All we have is fabric and supercomputers, so. Oh, okay. I was like, what the heck is that noise? 30 minutes. Well, we won't be seeing the end of that. <laughs> or we, we will, but like right at the end. Nice. Alright. Okay, so this guy's returning. That's good. Um, we're back into tier 6 now, so there we go. This is cleared. Now we just need our 50s. Or we need 50 of, of each. 
So what I need desperately. This is at 36. I think it's screws that are holding us up. Like like usual. You know how it goes. So this is what we're gonna do. Give me a stack of hundred. Actually I have I have like a stack of ninety-five. So we're gonna turn around and we're gonna go to this guy. And we're gonna give you ninety-five so you stop so you produce a little faster. Um, we shouldn't have like any stocked up, which is kind of a bummer, but this is what we're gonna do. I want to take a couple hundred. And I'm gonna go produce screws myself. That's, that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna make some screws to try and help this out, because like we're screws are always an issue for us for some reason. They just don't produce very quickly, even even after they've been um, what's it called? Even after it's been overclocked like a few times, it still just it just doesn't produce. I don't understand why, but it's not that big of a deal. What we're probably gonna do next is while we're waiting for those things to craft, I could go and craft the computers myself and just kind of do that. But I think what we'll do is we'll go out and find some slugs, and then we will overclock a few things to try and make things uh, work a little faster. I'm curious to find out also if we, um, if our modular frames, I'm curious to find out if our modular frames or if uh, anything else over there has gotten to the point where it's used up all of its resources and it's not really producing that quickly anymore. Um, so we'll find out about that as well. But first, we're going to make up all these screws. I might throw one stack of 500 screws into the box, so then it just distributes those screws to all the different locations, and then I'll go up and I'll put a stack of 500 in the computers, and I'll put a stack of 500 into the uh, like modular frames and stuff like that, or the reinforced whatever's done. Okay, we're just trying to help help the process out as much as we can, basically. Um, 500, slap you in there. That should help out for a moment. You, we're going to slap 500 into here. Pew. That will help out for a moment. And then we'll put 500 into you. Boom, that'll help out for a moment. So everything is always waiting for screws. Yeah, I want to get the steel pipes producing even faster. I'd, I'd almost like it if we, we didn't even make any in that um, box. Like if we didn't save any, that wouldn't bother me too much. These guys are probably capped out, I'm guessing. Yeah, all of these are capped out. They're just waiting for screws. So, cap you out with screws. That that should help a little bit. What I'm going to do is I'm going to wait here for a moment. And we're going to wait until this ends. And I'm going to throw another set in here. If it's backed up, it'll help out in the end. No. Okay. The more backed up it is, the quicker it'll go for, like, moments or whatever. If we want this whole line to back up as much as possible. It's never going to stay fully backed up because it uses so much. But the least we can do is try to, you know, back it up a little bit. So we'll wait for it to pop out. Luckily, this is, I mean, I say luckily, but it's really not that great that it's so slow. But luckily, it's slow, so it's not. It's not going to burn them really quick. Yeah, we have nine. We need 50. Computers are our slow thing for sure. There, so it'll burn 60 of these really quick because each each one of these is just a single thing of screws. So there we go. So it's gonna start pulling them up right like right about probably now. Let's put the rest of our screws into here, and this can just divvy them out. Boom! There you go. There you go, buddy. Dish them out as quick as you can, and then I think I will take. Hopefully take some more rods and plug them into this guy, right? Do I have any on me? No. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go like this. This may seem pretty dumb, but I'm going to do it anyways. We're going to go like this. I'm going to give you 100 rods. And then we're going to come over here. Does this guy have enough rods? Yeah. Um, we're going to go to this. And we're going to give this rods to... No, wrong thing. We need the one that spits out rods. This one. We're going to give this 100 rods to spit out. 
It, it is pretty dumb to do this, actually. I don't know why I'm doing it. Um, where's the other one that's making rods? This one. I'm going to give this one 100 rods to spit out. What we're trying to do is back up these lines again. So then it's all it's doing is feeding them to the ones that need. So we want these to back up. So then it's, it's going one, one as they're needed. And then spitting it, the rest of them into here. That's kind of the idea. There. But it's not going to last. That's the problem. So I, have, I would have to keep trying to catch this one as much as I can for it to last. So, But it should help it for a moment. It should help the whole process for a moment, which might make things a little better for a good second or two. This is taking a while. This is spitting out pretty slow, so it's just being consistent, which is good. All right. That might have helped the process just a smidge, but not a huge amount. We got the supercomputers going. Um, everything's going pretty well right now. Like we're we're pretty set at the moment. Um, let's jump up here. So we're not ending, but uh, I do need to take a quick bathroom break, and then we will continue. So I will be back in like two seconds. Alright, we're back. Whoops. No. 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 Okay. Sorry, I screwed something up. No, that's not what I want. Don't do the thing. Ah, I press buttons. I press buttons. <laughs> okay, there. That's good. Let's get back to it. So, now at this point, um... We should probably just look for slugs, which might be challenging at, at this point in the uh, in the game. Let's see. Can't look for slugs with this. We need to bring out the scanner. Don't do it. Uh, we're going to look for slugs so we can overclock some stuff. So let's bust out the old scanning kajigger. Well, that's not good. <laughs> We're getting like no signal for uh, for any slugs. Oops. Ouch. Hold on. So let's run this way a little bit. We might, maybe we'll get a, a beep or something. Oh my goodness. Why is it so blurred? When you sprint, it blurs the screen. Okay. Run this way. Sit up on top of that rock. How the heck am I supposed to get up there? Alright, so it's right up there. You can see the trails from it. We're going to have to sprint by this plant. No! Buddy! 
Bad plants. Stop. Yeah, I think it's right here. Thanks. All right, we need to get out of here. Whoa, poison plant. So we got one already. Dang it. There's probably one up there. Problem is this is like dead dead land right here. This is the the land of great death. Oh my goodness gracious. How the heck am I supposed to get up here, huh? There's one up there. I can see it. Alright, we're going for it. Run! Run! Oh no! I blew it! Where where are you? There you are. Run! Ouch! Bad plants. Better get ready. Boars tend to be around here. Let me guess. Up there. Oh, I see it. It's right in here. There they are. Told you. Oh, I can't get it because I'm on my chainsaw. Should have brought my chainsaw with me. It's okay. I can run faster than the boars now, so it's not a big deal. I should have brought the chainsaw. That was dumb. Oh, well. Are they still chasing me? It's very possible. Steve, my man, you're like flying really flow, really low today. Does he have like little bugs flying with him? Looks like he does. He's got babies. He's got little baby Steves. All right, so this way. Lost the trail. No? So it's like underground. It's gotta be underground, because like there's no there's no like passage. It's gotta be like an underground entrance somewhere over here. There's something. It's over here somewhere. There's like some kind of entrance that goes underground. There's gotta be. Oh, the water scared me. <laughs> I wasn't expecting water for some reason. Might be up there. Alright, we gotta find these slugs, man. We need to overclock. This is actually like a really dangerous thing to do too because uh, I have like the Skyrim logic so I'm less like, oh yeah, just run and like jump at the hill. It'll be fine. I'm guessing it's up there. gotta be on this. There's no other place it could be. Or out in the water, I guess. That's that's possible, too. What's that? Is that just dirt? Let's take a look. That was just dirt. Hopefully there's a climb-up spot right here. Yeah, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sprints McKenzie. Come on, slow down. See, going out and exploring is good because this will give time for. Oh! Yeah, I can't get up there. Forget you. What are these? I've seen these before and they freaked me out when I saw them last time, too. Right, we're looking around. This is the poison forest. This is not good. This isn't where we want to be. Uh oh, lagging. The farther you get from your base, the more you lag, it seems, by the way. Kind of weird. Got a cave somewhere? Oh, look at this. Can we even go down here? Oh, this is a poison cave. That's not a good cave. We don't want to go in that cave. Not yet, at least. What are you? Raw quartz. We don't have a use for you. I'm going to go down a little bit. 
Yep, this is a bad cave. This is a bad cave. Get out quick. Just making sure. We need... Do I not have any bacon on me? Oh my god. Great. That's... I'm such a genius for bringing no bacon. Super good idea, man. Just really, really good. Flower petals. Hmm. Here we go. Maybe this will lead to one. They love to grow on these big strips like this. At the very least, we might be able to see where one is at. Wait, he's... Is he... Oh my god! Is he getting up here? Whoa! Jeez! That's what you get, idiot. Alright. Sneeze time, sorry. This is an interesting area. I don't think I've been here. Where is my... I can't even s oh no, I can't even see my space elevator, man. It's over that way. Luckily, I've got a bunch of stuff that points me to my home. Maybe down here a little bit? Where in the French is this one? A little interesting little beach. Kind of fun to look around sometimes, see the things that like. were designed and stuff like that. Like, look at this. This is neat. It's diff. Uh oh. I should have seen this coming. Better get out the stick. Fighting time. Alright. Here we go. Bum bum ba da da. Bum bum ba da 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 da. Bum bum bum. Boom, 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 boom. Battle music. These guys can take some pain. Oi. Dodge. How come you can't smack the fireball back into their face? Come on. Make that a feature. Nice. I, I need the alien organs as well to be a, uh, a thing. Give me this slug quick. It's our third slug. Wow, look at this. This is beautiful. What's that? Oh, nothing. Okay. Wow, I really like being where I am right now. Uh-oh. Game doesn't like me being there, though. Oh, my God. See, this is some stuff they really need to work on. <laughs> Can't climb out. Whoa, this is cool, man. That's a geyser, so it's going to pop. I need to keep that in mind. Spiders are probably here. Good to know. A lot of spitters, man. A lot of fire spitters. Which is not the best. I'm going to run past this guy. What was that? Oh, that was a geyser. I just mentioned it, too. Aw, oh, man. We're about to get poisoned, I think. Whoa, red plants. What are these? Just leaves. Alright. That's boring. Just kind of exploring right now. Using up some time. You know how it is. Some coal. I don't really need that. Oh, hey. Oh, there's probably somebody to fight here. Nope. Just a green bird so far. Can I get into this? I doubt it. I have a feeling I won't be able to. Oh, look. Some frames. Nice. What did I just pick up? Oh, reinforced iron plates. Nice. Oh, of course. Holy crap, big guy! Oh, this isn't good. I don't have any other food with me. Oh, it's like a... It's one of the boss ones. I hate those. Rotors. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, all right. I'm going. I'm going. I'm sorry. Jeez. I get it. It's your home. Whoa. This dude is going to kill me. I need to get out of here. Ooh, some nuts. There we go. Would you jump? Stop being an idiot. You're going to die. Face of maneuvers. Dodge and weave. Is he chasing me? 
I can't. I don't have any food. Like I can't kill him. Otherwise, I would. If I had, if I had more like useful food, I would just go over there and just whoop him. But I don't. So it's dangerous right now. I didn't. I didn't come out prepared to fight. I came out prepared to find slugs, and that was it. Oh, some bacon. That's good. Give me the bacon. Give me the bacon. If we can get a bunch more bacon, I'll go kill him. Even though it doesn't really serve any purpose, honestly. That's the thing I've come to find. Like, I don't have the organ. Whatever you need the organs for, I can't seem to unlock it. Maybe because I need to unlock my cilia first. I'm not really sure, but as it stands right now, there's, like, no reason to fight any of them because I don't have a reason. I don't have anything I need yet. Wait a minute. Are we below our base? No, our base is way out that way. Should probably start heading back, honestly. I found another one of these creepy deserts. Full of fire spitters. Fire spitters for days. Whoa, look at these guys. You got a mate? What are you doing? They're standing so close to each other. No, we're kind of like at the end here. Well, that's a bummer. Cool. Alright. Well, that was interesting. It was a neat little area. Whoa, what's this? Probably spider cave, more than likely. Spiders? There you are. I knew you would come out of here. Bring it on, spider. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you. You don't look like a spider, actually. You look like something else. And there's the spiders. You're done. Come here, buddy. You're done. Give me that. Somer Sloop. Alright. Neat. It's still work in progress. Every time we find one of those, it's a... Basically, it's a reminder. We're in early access. Give me that. Um, I should probably re-equip... Probably re-equip the, uh... Scanner, but let's get out of here first in case I have to fight. I want to keep my weapon out. Leave me alone, Spitter. I got nothing to do with you, okay? We don't need to fight. We don't need to conversate. Let's go down here. If there's spiders, I'll kill them. It's not a big deal. What is that? Oh, it's a freaking like baby one. Who are you? Iron ore. Boo! Iron ore's boring. Is there anywhere else to jump from up here? No? I thought we were doing like a jumping puzzle here, man. I was like super excited for a moment there. Alright. I know you're here, Spitter. Get out of my way. Alright, let's head back. Let's head back and see how much progress we've made. We've got everything building now, which is good. Um but we're definitely not going to finish that tier off today. Like, not all of it. I'm just hoping to do at least one. What is up this way? Is that where we came down from, or did we come from this way? I don't remember. There's a part of me that really wants to, like, accidentally find something super giant and be, like, freaked out. Is that a yellow? That's not a good sign. The yellow power slugs are normally surrounded by really big enemies. Those are the little ones. Interesting. That doesn't match up with the uh, my predated beliefs. It was my belief that uh, the the yellow power slugs were surrounded by like normally by like big enemies and like really tough scenarios and stuff. Oh, speaking of big enemies, there he is next to the Somer Sloop. There's a lot, a lot of those Somer Sloops. <gasps> oh, he's ignoring me. Keep ignoring me, please. Uh-oh. Oh! I want this, dude. Go away. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Huh? What are you gonna do? You gonna send your little kids after me? Uh-uh, I don't think so. Whatever, I'm out of here, dude. I don't even care. I got what I wanted. Not that I have a use for it right now, but I got what I wanted. 
I took it from the big guy. That's all I care about. Whoa, fire spinner. That was sudden. Wow. We're out of here. We're done. We're done, Yun Rings. Game over. Finish. Finished. I'm done with you. No more. What is that up there? You see that? What is that? I'm... Is that charging up? You see that? I want that. Whatever that is, I want it. I want to know if it's a bad thing or if it's just a thing. I don't recognize that, so I want it. Okay, jump. Jump, jump, jump. What are you? Oh, it's another Mercer Sphere. I've seen, I've already seen a few of these, actually. This isn't the first Mercer Sphere to come around. Another work in progress thing. We're finding a lot of like work in progress stuff. Oops. Well, that's a bad idea. Ouch. Cool. Cool. We'll take more stuff. Why not? Probably need it in the future. I wonder if when they update this game again, if it's going to uh, like erase your old file. That would like really suck. Because we put a lot of time into this. But it would give us a lot to do again, so. I guess that wouldn't be all bad. Anyways, let's go up and see how many computers we have. We need 50. And our, uh, our ma'am is probably almost done too. Whoa, come on now. Go down here. Goody, goody gumdrops. See how many computers we got. Should have quite a few. 41, ah, oh, so close. Do I have screws on me? I think I picked up some screws, right? Not what I want. Stop. It's 68. This is burned through all of its screws already. That didn't take long. Everything else is... Oh, wow. The circuit boards aren't capped out. Probably because it uses screws to make those. What's wrong with the circuit boards? Is this the circuit board? What are you missing here? No, no, it's the wires. We need to move up some of those wires. Let's do that. That might help us out. Everything is really bright. It's like a super bright, shiny day. It's crazy, man. Tone it down there, son. Tone it down. All right, I'm gonna do another dangerous fall. Ah, damage. That's a lot of damage. All right. I don't wanna do take all because um, I just don't want that much. Oops. Let's get a couple thousand plugged into this. We got a lot of this. All right. Um, we can just take this up there. Wee. Bono bono bono. All right. So we want right tall. Very good. So slapping these suckers into here. That that should help it out a bit. If it can just be consistently locked down like this. It's just that this is using uh, more than everything else, I think. There, we put like, what, 3,000? Is that what we put into here? That should hold it off for a while. This is what I'm going to do, though. We're going to come down to this guy. We're going to go... This, this one's already capped out 500. This guy is not. So we're going to give you 500 there. That should help it back up a little bit. And then we can start so storing up perfect. Now we can store up more in there. And that'll help keep the flow going for this. Problem we're having again is the screws, like always. Alright, so the screws are almost at 120. It looks like it'll probably... Yeah, it's going to make it there because of the circuit boards. So that's cool. Alright. So let's go check on the uh, heavy modular frames. Maybe we can turn those in right now. We should gar be guaranteed 50 of those. Whoa. Let's check this out. Let's see what we got here. What? Why? 48. What are we short on? Steel pipes. Wow, the encased ones are... That's actually surprising to me. I didn't think we would be that high up for encased. It is literally the steel pipes that's the problem, though. I probably, in all honesty, could turn this off because we've got so many of these. 
I could probably just stop this guy constructing and then stop the staters. I think that's probably a good idea for now. Like, there's no reason to keep keep on making these. Not at the moment. I mean, we might, we might need to slap it back on in the future, but this would help us a lot if we had the staters not producing as well. Click. There we go. That's good. It'll build up and it'll backstock a bit, and that'll allow us to, like, basically... Um, don't we have a box for rotors? I think we have a box for rotors, and then we can stock up on those as well a bit. And so it's not a big deal to have this happen. Um, rotors... No, it looks like rotors just... Oh, no, they do. They feed into a box, and then the box feeds into this guy. Okay, cool. So this can get piled up, which is good. We'll let this pile up a bit. Because they're not... We're not needing any of that at the moment, so there's no reason to keep that running at right now. Um, that being said... Oh, that's what we're doing. We're going to go craft some more power cells so we can overclock... We can overclock the steel beams to the max, cause that's or the steel pipes, because that's what we need. Okay, so going down, we're going to do power shark. We're going to do a Oh, I got... Oh, no, it just makes two. I thought I got two yellow slugs. I was like, when did I get a second yellow slug? Okay, so we're going over here. Over here. Let's see if we've, um, before I do this, let's see if we're backstocked on this again. We are quite a bit, actually. We're backstocked on this a lot. So we're going to cap this sucker out right now. Um, here. Boom. And boom. 250%. Crank that. 17? Yeah, we're fine. It's still going to stay capped out. Look at this. Oh, that's because it keeps pulling out of here, duh. I'm an idiot. Let's, let's watch this for a second. We'll see if we're going to run out based on this. If it keeps going lower, then yeah, we will. So 52. Yeah, so basically what that means is in order to keep up the maximum steel pipes we need to come over here and we need to uh, slap one of them into this. And we just need one though. I don't think we'll need more than one. Just one of them should make it so... Wow. I jumped that up a lot. Um, just one of them though should make it so we get um, enough produced to where it, it holds up the capacity of the steel pipes. How are we doing here? Beautiful. I did turn off two machines though. So. So this line is, of course, stocked up because it's not feeding any in. Is this full? or Oh, it's just not feeding in. We're going to go like this. Slap that in there. There. So then whenever we do turn this back on, basically, it will be able to make, like, three of them before it has to stop. That's kind of the idea for that. This is feeding out... So that sped up a good amount. This is good. We're, we're, we're going to be producing a lot faster now, which is nice. This thing's probably almost full. Let's go check the MAM. Let's go see if the MAM is done. It should be. And then I think we have the 50 frames, but we're like not even close for computers, I think. All right. Supercomputers analyzed. Uh-oh. New Nothing technologies else. have been developed based on this new element, primarily in power and electronics, and can now be accessed in Hub Tier 6. Fantastic. We got something for Hub Tier 6. So, yeah. What do we get? Let's find out. Advanced Caterium Electronics. Geothermal Generator. Can only be built on a geyser node. Okay. Generates electricity for your power grid. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Scan for geysers. Nice. Programmable splitter. Um, another one, I guess? It's weird. Power pull mark three and inventory slots. Uh, uh, not the most exciting. I mean, the geothermal generator is pretty cool. But... I don't even know if you can use it though, because when you go to a geyser, when you go to a geyser, it tells you like, like this is still like a work in progress or whatever. Is this just regular modular frames? It is. 
and motors. This one's going to be easy. It's just a supercomputer that we have to build. We'll probably do this uh, milestone by hand. And we'll leave the other ones to be built by our machines and stuff. Um, well, that's pretty cool. I think one thing that we need to do right now, really quick, is go cut, cut down some trees. Because we need to make fabric. So I need my cilia. So I need the... Uh, I need my old chainsaw. I haven't popped this sucker out in a long time. Don't do that, please. Give me the chainsaw. And give me some of this. Okay. We'll cut down some trees real quick. We need big trees, though. Like this guy. Because we need ones that give us mycelia. Um, what do we need? Let's see. We're going to craft fabric. Is fabric even in here, or is it somewhere else? I think it's somewhere else. Uh, fabric. Fabric. It's leaves and one mycelia. We already have... How much fabric do we already have? We can already do this for a lot. I need ten mycelia. I mean, I need ten. Is it ten? Yeah, I need ten fabric, so... Over here real quick. Or it's six fabric. So I just need four mushrooms. That's all I need. So let's go cut down some trees real quick. We'll get this guy going and then that's probably where we'll, we'll call it for the day. So let's see what happens. Nope. We need, what was it, four mycelia? Here we go. So we got three from that. We need like the busted down stump ones. Doesn't seem to be like the full trees that give us any mycelia. Uh oh, I think people are starting to do yard work outside. Um, it is that day. Tuesday seems to be yard work day. We've come to find. All right, so it's these stumps that give us the mycelia, or not? Yeah, there we go. Good. I think that's all we need. But I'm gonna. It doesn't hurt to grab a couple extra though while we have the chainsaw. Ring. Can I reach it from here? Oh, come on, please. Dang it. I was really hoping I could reach it from right here. <laughs> Just chop it down from, like, long range. Long range chopping. It'd be kind of funny if you could, like, go up to the mushrooms on the ground and cut them with the chainsaw. <laughs> You're, like, stabbing the chainsaw into the ground. I'm gonna get you mushrooms. Should be able to get this guy from here. No. Needs to be closer to the base. That's fine. Whoops. Uh, you. Uh, I'm not getting any of the mycelia because you need the stumps. Like, here we go. This will probably give us a lot. Like we're this one right here. Yeah, we got five mycelia from that. So we need like fallen over stumps and dead trees and stuff like that. It's not going to come from. A living tree that's gonna come from like these guys which is good to know I'm just kind of grabbing a couple more while I'm out and about because uh, that way I'll have them if in case fabric becomes important I just have a feeling that it might so all right get back over there Pew. I love the chainsaw it definitely doesn't get used enough all right one sec Sorry about that. I didn't know if the scraping from the person's shovel outside could be heard, so I figured I would just shut my window real quick. Ah, yeah, I didn't know. Apartment I'm at, they like to do weird stuff on Tuesdays, so. Okay, so we're making fabric. We're making fabric out of mushrooms. Mushroom fabric, if you will. Mushroom fabric. We have a ton of leaves now. Almost too many, you could say. We're going to put these leaves away because I don't need to keep them on me. Um, if we have wood, I'll put it away as well. Just slap it in here for now. It's a good place to put it. we got so much wood. Too much. Too much wood. Get it out of here. Where did I get this biomass? Whatever. Um, I made enough. So let's get over here. We're going to go fabric. How long for that? Seven minutes? Boo. All right. So that's all set. Let's go see how we're doing on the uh, on this front real quick. 
How are you looking? So we got 50 here. That's good. Um, how are we doing with this? Oh, sorry. That's right. Wrong thing. Um, I want to go put the chainsaw away really quick because it's like really in my face. So we're going to put this in a box. I think I have a box that has like all my equipment and stuff in it. Yeah. So, summer sloop. We'll throw some of those in there. Uh, I gotta unequip it. You dingus. Okay. Chainsaw. You go in here. Power. Okay. Good. Okay. Um, let's go see how many computers we have. Didn't it say we had like 41 when we were up there last time? I hope so. <laughs> I want to send off this first tier before we call it. Like, this has been really productive. I mean, we didn't finish one of the hub tiers, like one of the main ones, but we did get ourselves set up to where we're producing everything we need. Nice. For our hub tiers. So it, it literally is just time. And then as we unlock the tiers, we'll start building the things that are associated with them, um, which is going to be kind of tough because I think we'll build some of those by hand so then we're not taking from these um, crafters that are building our... Uh, pieces that we need. So, let's go send this off. Bing, bing, bingo. You go here. And you go here. Perfect. Sha sha. 14 minutes. Milestone so now reached. we are able. The fuel generator will match power generation to the increased consumption of recently acquired technologies and buildings. Additionally, improved conveyor belts can now be constructed. Nice. So they have a fuel generator. What a fuel generator takes is circuit boards, cables, and that. And it either it makes 150, wow, or it makes 50. And it consumes fuel to generate electricity for your power grid. Has an input so feeding fuel can be automated. So, wow, this thing is huge. Holy jabroni. What I'm thinking we're going to do is, not this time, but next time, we're going to go down to our oil um, facility down there. The, that we have down in the uh, in the slums over here that we have feeding up oil I think oh my god it's so funny what we'll do is we'll go we'll go down here next time and we will basically create a way for that to power itself using the fuel generator so what we'll have to do is it needs fuel not oil so we'll have to make is an oil refinery so then the oil refinery can take the oil um, like it does up top That way it can take the oil and turn it into fuel and then uh, I'm actually we need to go up here really quick because I think Doesn't it take uh, Let's just go up here uh, oil refinery Fuel no fuel just takes oil, okay, I didn't know if it took um I didn't know if it took like plastics and rubbers and stuff to make it. I didn't know if it was like oil and plastic or something to make the fuel. So what we can do is convert it to fuel and then we can put it in there over where our um, oil, mine, oil drilling facility is over on the side. Um, like way over there or something. And we'll have it so it cycles the power in and then kind of like powers itself. So we'll basically have an infinite source just like we do, um, just like we do with the coal. Like, I, it's not, uh, never mind. That's not going to be the same thing. The coal is like, it has its, it feeds itself, basically. And so we have one coal facility over there that just like will never die no matter what we do. Um, and so we'll always have coal, even if like we screw up on the machines here, coal will still feed from that. So that was kind of my, my feelings on that over there. But I want the fuel generator to affect all of our stuff here. So that's not going to be the same. But... That'll be something that we'll work on, like, next time. Um, what does it take to make the oil refinery? All right, steel pipes, cables, all that stuff. So when we go to do that, I'll have to bring this with me, and I'll have to bring um, this stuff with me. Circuit boards, all this stuff is pretty easy to make. It's only going to take five heavy frames, and then it's just pipes, pipes, and a lot of cables and circuit boards. Circuit boards, luckily, as well, aren't that hard to make. So we'll just make our five for ourselves or whatever. And then that'll boost us up 150 and we'll make that refinery. And then hopefully by the time we're done that, done with that, it will have enough to make, um, uh, what's it called? We'll have enough to make 
Dang it, what's it called? Why can't I remember this? Uh, we'll have enough for the next hub tier. But, uh, I, I, yeah, I don't know. We'll see when that time comes. This has two minutes. Let's, let's just grab up what we need right now. And then we'll end it. So I'm not gonna end it just yet. I like, I wanna see what happens from the fabric. I'm really curious. So give me 50 of these. Um, I know that we're gonna need... I don't need the 50 for... I think I can... Do I have oil on me? Do I have any oil? I have some plastics on me. What does it take to make the circuit boards again? Isn't it plastic and screws? Could be terribly wrong. I'm not really sure. Circuit boards. Plastic and wires, and it takes a lot of plastic too. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. Luckily, I have a bunch of oil right here that I can just pull from. There we go. We'll just make the plastic ourselves. Bing, bam, boom. Five circuit boards. One, two, three, four, five. So we'll hold on to that. Let's see, what else does it take? So we need a bunch of cables. So can I even make any cables right now? I can, and I can make enough for this as well. Let's just make up like 100 cables right now. Basically, we're getting everything that we need, so then next time, we're kind of burning two minutes so then we can get the fabric thing back, just because I'm curious. Okay, um, so cables, and then we need five heavy frames. Oil refinery, 20 pipes. Yeah, 20 pipes, five heavy frames. We're just getting ourselves set up, basically. Um, 20 pipes, can I get these pipes? We don't have any stocked up, of course. Um, should just grab now screw this just give me this I'll just make them myself <laughs> I was gonna just like sit there and keep grabbing them as they came out onto the conveyor belt but I was like don't do that just just make them yourself good lord okay um, we need 20 of those is that what that was wow okay we can make a ton with a hundred okay. I should probably make a couple of these as well because I'm gonna have to do some connecting so I'm not going to use all of this up, but that's that's what we can do. Okay, so, oil refinery. 20, 20, 5, and we need those. Okay. Fuel generator. 25, got it. 5, 5, 3. All right. So let's go grab. Let's go grab those 5, and then we'll see if the mycelia, if the fabric is done. Because I want to know if it makes, like, something different for us. I'm just, like, out of curiosity. I don't want to leave yet. So we need five of these. Yeah. Slap that. There we go. So next time when we start, we have everything we need to make all of those things for the fuel generator. And so we could just go down and do that. Um, let's see if the ma'am is done. If it's not, yeah, it is. Okay. What do you got to tell me now? What's going this on? This fabric is suitable for the creation of parachutes. What? The derived blueprint is now accessible in hub tier two. Parachutes? Oh, what? Show me that. Hub tier 2. Yeah, look at how many we've gotten into there. That's crazy. Wow. It goes onto your body. Slows down your fall when activated in midair. It really shouldn't. But I'm gonna. Oh, the pod's out. I can't do it. All right. Well, that's what that's what we'll start with as well next time. <laughs> Cuz I was like, I was like I'm going to make a parachute. <laughs> I need to go though. I'm pushing my luck. I'm pushing my luck like I always do. That was weird. Yeah, I'm I'm pushing my luck like I always do and uh I need I need to go cuz I've got to I've got to finish getting ready for work. So I cannot I need to not do what I did a couple weeks ago where I oh, where I basically pushed it to the point where I was uh, almost late, so but we're gonna collect up everything we need and uh, and we'll deal with that la next time. The pod will return and be returned probably before we even start next time, so that's that won't be a big deal. But uh, anyways, like I'll go in and slap that in, and we'll make a parachute, and we'll parachute down and make the fuel generators. Oh my god, everything's perfect. 
It's gonna fit so well. Look at this mess. Look at this beautiful, beautiful mess of a factory. It's so sloppy, but I just love it so much. But that is gonna be where we stop for today, guys. Next time, I'm gonna be honest, I have a distinct impression that next time might be our last stream for Satisfactory. So if everything works out, um, either that'll be Saturday or that'll be like Sunday or something. I'm not really sure, but the next Satisfactory one's probably going to be the last one for a while. And then we'll pick up a different game until um, more stuff comes out for this game. But either way, if you want to watch back on any of uh, this or any other game that I've been streaming, you can do so on youtube.com slash mrbagels, or you can watch it in the collections on twitch.tv slash mrbagels, which is also where you can watch it live. Um, that is going to be it for today. Thank you so much for joining me, guys, and I hope you will join me next time. I am Mr. Bagels. Goodbye. <laughs>